Hello, I'm Rosie and today I'm going to be doing Fairy Loot Unboxing! Yay! I just got back from holiday and I am really tired after travelling for probably nearly 24 hours over the weekend. But I got back and my Fairy Loot box had arrived and so I'm going to unbox it for you. This is the box for July. I don't, can't remember what the theme is but we'll find out when I open up the box. For anyone who doesn't know, Fairyloot is a book subscription service and each month it sends you a book and a number of bookish goodies which relate to the theme of the month. But I'll leave the link in the description below if you are interested and um, I will unbox this now. Let's see what's inside. Okay, so the first thing, oh, I'll put this down. So, the first thing I see is the card of the month and it comes with a nice design and the theme for July is Tricksters and it's also got spoilers on the back and so I'm not going to look at that because I don't want to be spoiled as to what is inside. Whoa! So, the second thing I see is a mug. Let me open this mug. So this is the mug and as you can see it's, it says I have to go to my mind palace which is a quote from the TV series um, Sherlock from BBC. Um, but yeah it's quite a nifty mug. I like do like the concept of a mind palace so I quite like this mug. Tired. Uh, right. Okay. Ah. I then see um, some body lotion put this a bit closer so you can see it. It is Loki Essence of Trickster um, body lotion. So curious to see what that smells like. Hmm. Smells quite interesting. I have to give that a go one day and bring out my inner trickster. What else do we have in here? Ooh. <gasps> oh I see Harry Potter. These are playing cards from Harry Potter. Um, yeah, but I don't actually play cards myself, but this might give me an excuse to actually start playing. Um, what else? <sighs> oh, I've taken the next thing out of the bag, because it's quite loud, but it is an oven glove with decorations from fortune telling, so it's got, I presume, well, things from the occult. But yeah, that's quite, I quite like the colours on that. Can always do with them. Oh, There's then three cards. So the first one is discount card for I think soap. Um, oh, bookmark from the Six of Crows, and it reads better terrible truths than kind lies. Six of Crows. That's quite a nice bookmark. Ah. Uh -huh. And then we have a quote from Harley Quinn and that says it doesn't matter who broke you down what matters is who made you smile again that's quite a nice quote and harley quinn is pretty cool so ooh, i believe that brings me to the book so the book comes in this nifty little bag to protect it from and um let's find out what it is oh I, I spy purple which is always good. Ooh. Ooh. So the book is Daughter of the Burning City by Amanda Foody. Um, I've not heard of it, but it sounds pretty cool. Set in a festival of burning desires. So I'm looking forward to reading this book. Um, and then there's a few other things here in here as well. Okay, so the first thing I see is um, a book plate, a signed book plate to go in the book so it can be signed. The Trickster's bookmark and my reading buddy hashtag. Letter from the author which I will read after I film this video. And the Fairy Scoop newsletter which has interview with the author in it as well as um, information about the next box. The theme for August is Other Worlds. So that's the end of my Fairy Loot unboxing. I hope you enjoyed that. So thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.